Hello friends, this is MJ Alam. Today I am going to try Mazda version 126 uh, with VCM1. Uh, let's see. You see, this is the VCM1. I am trying to communicate with Mazda 126 version. Uh, you see, it's communicating with the software. And you can see here the version. 126 now I'm trying to <coughs> communicate with the vehicle you see now communicating uh, see they recognizing the vehicle Mazda 3 and doing the network test you see the icon of the uh, VCM1. Select yes. Okay. Now I recognize the vehicle, everything. Within. Now I'm trying to do the self test on CMDTC. It's reading the continuous DTC. You see, right now lots of DTC because this vehicle have some problem. Lots of U code and things like that. It's okay, leave as it is. That's it. Now I will try data logger. Module PCM. Communicating with the module. You see all the pits came. You can select whatever you want. Uh, <clears throat> you can select which one you want and check. Uh, suppose uh, APP1, APP2, APP voltage. Okay. You see. That's it. Now you can go body, security, and suppose security pad function. Uh, if you want parameter reset, advanced key, registration of new key, everything. Right now I'm not going to do anything. Changes. You can do the sensor initialization. Tire pressure monitoring system reset, electrical, <coughs> x ray light, power train, OVD, two test mode, engine oil maintenance monitor. Everything you can do with VCM1, like uh, any VCM2. Uh, model programming, uh, I want to check if I have the new TCM patch. You see, this vehicle have the new TCM patch uh, from A to B.